popular task management app developer Todoist has now released a mobile optimized version of its Windows 10 Preview app for Windows 10 Mobile. I'm Oliver from WinBeta, and in this video I'm going to examine the Todoist Preview apps for both Windows 10 versions. In following the typical patterns of universal app design, the user interfaces between both the Windows 10 and Windows 10 Mobile versions are virtually identical, partitioned into two sections side by side of each other. The left side of the app is responsible for organizing the app's content. This includes views for the inbox, today, the next seven days, as well as tabs for your own customizable projects. On the right side is where the actual tasks themselves can be seen and managed. A great feature of Todoist's system is that in addition to building a simple list of tasks, you can also make subtasks by simply dragging a task into an indent region underneath another task. There are some behavioral oddities with this. Both Windows 10 versions of this app allow you to indent subtasks freely with no regard for the hierarchy, which can make for some really bizarre arrangements. I don't think this is intentional, as the more refined iOS version doesn't allow for this. Also a bit strange is that there's no way that I've found to view tasks that you've already completed. So if you accidentally check off a task, or find that you have to redo a task because WinBeta Editor-in-Chief Ron's standards are too high for you, you're out of luck, at least on the current Windows 10 versions. The iPhone version, for example, has this functionality plainly visible. Tapping on each individual task exposes several menu options that allow you to modify the specifics of each task. There's a huge breadth of precise yet easy to use options available, provided you are not among the proletariat. What I mean by this is that in addition to creating an account for basic usage and ubiquitous cloud syncing over all the major computing platforms, some of the more, well, most of the more desirable features require becoming a premium member, which entails a $28.99 US dollars per year subscription. Some of these features include task searches, color-coded labels and projects, task notes, file uploads, task and location reminders, adding tasks via email, and more. Unfortunately, there seems to be no visible way to obtain a free trial to sample these premium features. All told, the app has a simple, easy-to-understand layout with a clean interface and trivial behavioral problems that should be sorted out in due time. It's very exciting that Todoist is bringing its task management offering to not only Windows 10, but also Windows 10 Mobile, showing that there is interest in developing apps for the universal platform. See you guys next time.